first of all, you're mingling with some local school kids today. What's the favourite part about um, getting up close with some of the little fans? Um, probably the questions they ask. Um, you get some absolute doozies out there. We had um, um, we had a sort of super clinic, Auskick super clinic last night. Um, so that was interesting. But look, it's pretty fun. Like, the boys get around and really embrace it. So. Um, those sort of nights are fun and even today um, school kids come out and get to experience uh, Metricon Stadium which is a great stadium and um, yeah just get to you know sort of embrace our facilities and it's good it's good fun. What's the most memorable question you've been asked by a little kid? <laughs> I get a lot of questions um, asking if I'm Michael Riscatelli but like, I don't really see the resemblance at all but I always get there's always one that says you're number 35 aren't you and I'm just no, I'm not. So, no, you get some, you get some interesting ones. A lot of them are just statements, really, and they're not really questions. So, um, it's always funny. You got better hair than Michael. Oh come on, <laughs> no comment. Um, Hawthorne this weekend down in Tassie is going to be absolutely freezing. Yep. How does that help or disadvantage you guys with your prep, or what are you guys bracing for in terms of temps down there? Um, we've played there a few times against Hawthorne and it's always been sort of hard conditions, um, contested football. Um, so we're really excited for the challenge and you know, we get to go, go there and um, prove again that we can contest with the best. And um, We've had a good couple of weeks strung together, um, where we've really showed good signs so we're really excited to get down there. Hawthorne showed against the Roos, they're not a team that goes away easily, um, that, that'll be a danger element for you guys. But do you feel like you've, you've built enough momentum leading into the bye that you can also show that you're going to stick in there? Yeah, well, we're extremely confident as a playing group um, to go down there and um, give it our best. I think they're a side that just they just win close games and they just finish really strongly. So, um, you know, we'll, we'll go through our game plan the exact same as we would every other week, um, try and execute that, but knowing there's no, there's no harder opponent than Hawthorne. So it's going to be a tough task, but we're up for it and we're extremely confident going to Tasmania. What's it like having injured troops returning into the club? Is that, that must be a boost for you guys, knowing that your side's getting stronger? Yeah, it gives us extreme confidence. I think um, you know if you look at our first four or five weeks of the of the year, where we had a had a good list and we had a um, strong list, and then the injuries came through, and um, we had to bring players up that m may have not had a chance this year um, with our best 22 out there. So um, yeah, it gives us just another block of confidence, I guess, having um, players back that are in our best 22, and um, we've showed the last couple of weeks that we can compete. And um, obviously, disappointing to not get over the line, but we we move on from um, last weekend and take positives out of that as well.